maybe I bought it for myself. I don't know yet. If he pisses me off today, he's not getting it. Oh my gosh, that is such a toxic trait. Okay, that was a joke. I was absolutely not serious. I'm cutting that out. Just got home. My honey boo bought me these flowers the other day. However, I just had these and the bouquet was not big enough to split in two to have more than one. So we're gonna make a little concoction. Just came home, stopped by the grocery store, and I bought this bouquet of roses and this bouquet of shrubs at this point. This is real cheap. This is ten dollars. This one was twenty dollars. So we're gonna make two bouquets out of this. And I got like a bit of groceries. Not really because I went to the grocery store the other day. What I really got was sweet potatoes and um, AirPod in. As soon as I come home, I plug my AirPod in. When I'm going to bed, I plug my phone in. So when I wake up in the morning, it's charged because if my alarm does not go off, it's it's over for me. If I can take everything with me. Oh, I need aspirin too. Because we're going to put some aspirin in the water. I got these baby aspirins at work. We're about to go see what we can come up with. Put y'all, where are we going to put y'all? Hold on, because we're going to put, put y'all. It's not a pillow. Here's my little reusable bag. This is some paper plates. Time to work out. This workout was not great, but like whatever. As in literally whatever. So, here's what I'm gonna do. They said bleach is pretty good too, but I'm trying one at a time. When I get new roses, what I typically do is um, put some cold water in the vase or vase, whatever you guys say. So, let's see if we can get the two bouquets together right now. So that's two, and we're gonna pour this in one container, and we're literally gonna be doing the same thing for the other one. Talk to my Insta stories a little bit too, because I haven't been on there in so long. Look like a toenail. I feel like I haven't come on here and spoken to my phone in a hot little minute, but I just popped by the grocery store, and I bought myself some flowers, because I always get, so I feel like it's only right that I buy myself some. I bought myself these little, I don't know what these are, like flowers, shrubs, flowers. And this was for $10. And then I bought this pair of some red roses. So, so cute. And they're like almost tightly closed. So I'm going to have like a good while with them. However, I already have like a few from the last batch that I got. This is what's left. And these are very pretty. So I'm going to mix all three of them together and see if I can get like two sets for both of my vase or vase. Whatever you guys say. We're going to agree to disagree here. And um, yeah, I'm going to do that. But I'm, I'm putting some aspirin in the water because I heard that putting aspirin in the water makes them last a little bit longer. As I'm talking about the aspirin, I literally feel like my friend Joissa for, forgot to get aspirin at work today to put on hers. I'm going to text her and ask her as soon as I come. I feel like Jules may have forgotten to ask for aspirin at work today so she could put in um, her vase. So I'm going to have to text her and ask her. But I put it in here and I'm going to put some cold water in there and then I'm going to like arrange the two um okay or whatever and see what we come up with i feel like what i also didn't realize is how rewarding it feels just buying yourself some some flowers you know some roses whatever it is it does feel really really good to be surprised with them but it also feels really good to get yourself some so take my foolish advice and get yourself some roses don't sit around and wait for somebody to buy you some but if somebody does buy you some it's nice, and don't be like that girl on TikTok who is expecting them to bring a vase too. And I like when the roses are pretty much like tightly closed like this because that means that you have like a longer time with them. Like as the days progresses, they're gonna like open up a little bit more. Love that. Love that for us. I'm 
and that is what we have. This will go on both my nightstands and I'm literally so happy with these. I need to sweep up the floor because it's a mess. Okay, now to the groceries. <laughs> Gonna put these away until I take them in the room. When I do take them in there, I'll like show you guys what the setup is like. So I bought some sweet potatoes. Oh, I bought some chicken too. I thought I was gonna make this. Am I still gonna make this? Maybe I am. I don't know. Maybe I'll just season it right now. And then I bought some sweet potatoes because my camera battery is blinking. <laughs> That's not the reason why I bought sweet potatoes. But um, what I was gonna say is typically when I'm trying to eat healthier, I will buy sweet potatoes, and these are the ones that I that I buy. They're called Korean batata in the grocery store that is by my house. But um. I like to just bake them. So well, that's good. I need to put these plantains in the fridge. I saw some ripe plantains at the grocery store just now when I went. And I was so tempted to buy them because they were beautiful ripe plantains. No black marks like these. Let me show you these. No black marks like these. However, when it's like this, it's like so much sweeter and so much better. But it means that they would last longer if they weren't already black. And I literally have like, what do I have there? I have five that looks exactly like the one that I showed you guys. But like I really need to express some self-control because I literally have some at home that I have not even gone through yet. I'm not going to buy more for it to spoil because we're not wasting food. I bought this for because... Or maybe I bought it for myself. I don't know yet. If he pisses me off today, he's not getting it. Oh my gosh, that is such a toxic trait. Okay, that was a joke. I was absolutely not serious. I'm cutting that out. So yeah, I bought these because we're trying to eat healthier. So we're going to see how this works out. <laughs> they were selling this in the grocery store and I really like it. It's like just a fruit blend. What do they have in here? Cranberries, walnuts, almonds, black raisins, golden raisins, peanuts, pepita, pepitas, and sunflower seeds. I don't know what the pepitas are, but I'm pretty sure it's not that hard to figure out when I pour some of them out into something. So there's that. And it wasn't too much. And I bought a can of Kalaloo and a can of Aki because these are Jamaican delicacies. I didn't even remember that I had these because had I remembered, I would not have bought two. So maybe I should use those first. And I have some Kalaloo. The Kalaloo I could do for like breakfast or whatever. So we'll see. And then that's it. That's all I bought at the grocery store. And I need to put my reusable bag back because when I'm going to the gym, this is what I throw all our stuff in to use. To just carry with me. Let me see why I spent $70. That's so crazy because I spent a lot of the grocery store the other day. It was $2.49 per pound. Oh my god, I got seven pounds. It's so heavy. Flowers, $4.99 and $18.99. So I was right about the little flowers, the random flowers. Those were $4.99. And those are very cute, but I feel like those are like nice fillers to make you know look more full. Because had I just had the 10 roses the thing would have looked very naked and I would have to like cut the stems really really short for it to look like anything so that's cute what else is on there I bought some chicken for $6.28 whatever it doesn't matter I spent $70 and 33 cents and what's alarming about that is that I literally just went to the grocery store a couple of days ago so I can't even mention that I stopped by the grocery store I mean it'll be known anyways because these flowers where did I get those from it is what it is <laughs> I'm gonna put these in my room and I'm gonna show them to you guys these are so cute. I literally love these so much. Oh, and then I have the paper plates that I bought. So we're going to go back to the kitchen. What I know is that we're going to be turning these lights off. The battery is blinking like nobody's business, but we're going to just roll with the punches here, okay? Okay. And the paper plates, I literally buy them in like the biggest container they're sold in so they last a while. How much is in here? These should literally last until um, next year. <laughs> I think it's so funny how we start seeing next year so quickly as if it's not like two months away or a month away. <laughs> I literally have a sweet tooth right now so I think I'm gonna eat a magnum. Hey Siri, hmm? text Julissa Adams. What do you want to say? Did you get the aspirin from work? Your message to Julissa Adams says, did you get the aspirin from work? Ready to send it? Yes. Okay, it's sent. Siri is worth every money I paid for that phone. Okay, so what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna season up this chicken. 
and then I'm gonna watch some TV. I don't know that I'm gonna cook this right now, but I also don't know that I'm not. So I'll see you guys later because the battery is also dying and like I gotta go charge it and stuff. So I'll see y'all later or whenever I do. And if this is the end of this vlog, well, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys buy yourself some flowers. And I will see you guys in the next video. After you buy yourself some flowers. <laughs>